Hi, kindergarten students. I hope you are ready to be an engineer today because I sure am. I'm so excited about getting to do our engineering build today. So you should make sure that you have this packet. What is biomimicry? And bio means life or anything that's living and mimic means to copy. So when we are engineers using biomimicry, we are copying living things. We're copying nature. Now we did the first part of this packet and we are going to turn to the last page. That's the one that we're on right now. And this is the problem. Alex wants to ride his bike. He needs to protect his head in case he falls. I hope you guys all make sure that you protect yourselves when you're riding a bike or a scooter. This is the challenge. Using a turtle as a model, make something for Alex that will protect his head. So remember, a turtle has a hard shell, but it doesn't only have a shell just on top, right? The shell connects underneath the turtle's body. So we need to be inspired by a turtle. Here is a picture of a turtle. So I'm gonna be inspired by that turtle and see if I can come up with a really good idea to protect my head. If you are at school, you have been given some of these pencil box cardboard sheets. And these pencil box cardboard sheets are really great because they can bend really nicely. So you can use them to go over your head if you would like, if that's what you would like. If you're at home, you might not have those things. So you might need to just get some other cardboard. I had a great idea. I have some egg cartons. And one of the things I like about the egg cartons is that they're different levels. So I could use my egg cartons. I could put two together like this. Ooh, I think this is actually a really great idea. But now I need to have something that's going to connect so that it will keep my egg carton on my head. Some other materials that you will you need, you need some tape. You might, if you're at school, you might want to use some clips. Pipe cleaners are awesome because they're really flexible and yet you can twist them and they'll stay connected. Now, another thing that I'm gonna use because I'm at home is I'm gonna use a nice soft winter scarf because I wanna have a little bit of padding. I want something to be soft. Now, you could, if you don't have a winter scarf, you could use an, a towel or some type of a cloth if you're at school, you might want to have something that adds some padding. Well, you could use some flattened uh, cups because they add a little bit of give to them. You could add a couple of layers of maybe crumpled up tissues to add softness. There's so many great ideas. The first thing I need to do is I need to draw a plan. I'm gonna think about the materials I have and then I'm going to draw out a plan for building my helmet. So here's the picture. I want to go into more detail. So I'm going to open my packet and I'm going to draw something on the back. I made a list of the materials and I drew a sketch of my plan for my helmet. I have some cardboard and you know, the cardboard is hard to bend. So I'm not gonna make it rounded. I know it's probably going to be more bent. I put some cloth on the inside of my cardboard and it could be tissues, it could be cloth, it could be whatever I have at home. And I use some pipe cleaners. Now, if you don't have pipe cleaners, maybe you could use some string or some yarn. 
So now this is my plan and I'm going to start building it. One of the things I really like about these pencil boxes is it has these holes that I can use to put my pipe cleaners in. I took my pencil box and I folded it in half so that it would fit over my head better. Yeah, this looks better. Now I wanna make sure I add that padding. I taped a cloth on the inside of the cardboard so that it provides a little padding. Oh, maybe I need to tape it up in the front too because it's kind of fallen down. Okay, I taped it on all the way around and now it doesn't fall down on my face when I've got my helmet on. It's pretty soft. Okay, now I added some pipe cleaners in the holes of my box. And now I'm gonna try to put on my helmet. The great thing about pipe cleaners is that they're flexible, right? And I can put them on and off several times. I don't have to have it just one time. Ooh, hey, I'm kind of liking this. Kindergartners, whenever I work on an engineering project, I'm usually pretty happy with it, but there's always something I can do to make it better, to improve on it. So I like my helmet, but I'm wondering if there are some things that I could do to make it better. Well, it still maybe could be a little softer. Maybe if I added another layer of cardboard, it would provide more protection. And also, the back of my head is not protected. So maybe if I added some cardboard down the back. So those are ways that I could improve my project. Every engineering project can be improved in some way. So I'm just thinking of some ways that I could improve my engineering project for next time. You guys, I love doing engineering with you. I'll see you next week, Cougars.